This could be the last one. Are you sure you don't want to intro? I'll let you have it. I can't say I'm no, fine tomorrow. No, you just say, and we're back. I'll let you have it. And we're back. Here I am, Fly Navarro with Fly Zone Fishing. I'm here with Grant from Cotton Caper Seafood. We got ourselves a Florida spiny lobster. We do. And you're going to show us how to properly clean it to make sure we don't lose any of the meat. That's right. A lot of guys will just grab their lobsters and twist the tails off. Uh huh. Which, you know, if, if you have a lot of lobsters and you just want to get it, get through it and you don't really care, that's fine. But uh, when you really want to get the most out of it and you're leaving a lot of the best meat up inside the head. Okay. So the first thing to do is grab your lobster. You're gonna actually stick the knife in right here. There's a little tab around that last leg. So stick that knife through. You see where the knife's coming through right there? Yep. And we're gonna just go right there and break it through that tab. Do the same thing on the other side. And then you're gonna hold down the tail and grab the carapace. You're gonna pull the head up. Okay. Next thing, use your thumb to break that little membrane right there on the bottom. Which little membrane? Oh, this the one, one right here, the one that connects it there. Okay. So you just kind of run your thumb around it and break that, and then pull the head. Holy smokes. So you get all that nice, all that nice head meat right there. It's, you add about another 10% to it by doing that, all right. which is nice. So then you can kind of clean up that part. Then if you want, when you're going to bake it, if you want to do something a little bit different, you can do what we call piggybacking. So right, I call that right between the eyes right there. You're gonna put your knife, not go all the way through. I'm just using like it as a lever. Yep, okay. just using it as a lever. We're gonna pull the vein out. And then we're gonna pull the meat of the lobster itself out without disconnecting it at the tail. Whoa. And then lay it out. You just leave it right like that on your baking sheet. And just add butter. Just butter? Yep, whatever you want. Butter, salt and pepper, whatever seasonings you like. You're good to go. Looks yummy. It does. Well, there you have it. Thanks for joining us here in the Fly Zone.